Welcome to Source Fed Nerd, I'm Sam Basher. And I'm Whitney Moore. Today's episode is brought to you by The Color Red. Everybody lost their shit on Twitter yesterday after Rockstar Games posted this image of their logo splashed over a nice wash of that special shade of Redemption Red. And if that's not enough of an indication that red, 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 and if that's not enough of an indication that Red Dead Redemption is coming back to us soon today, Rockstar Games also tweeted this image of seven cowboys just moseying up a hill looking all badass. People have been speculating on the similarity between this poster and the Magnificent Seven, which would be a clever nod to the classic Western or Maybe it's a hint that this next game will have some rootin' tootin' online multiplayer action. Mm -hmm. Rootin'. I love Red Dead Redemption. Back in April, a supposed map for Red Dead Redemption 2 leaked, and an independent source, Ooh, mysterious. very mysterious, claimed that it would be a prequel set to just east of the OG map. It makes sense that this would be a prequel, considering that the first game ended on a pretty permanent note, so hopefully we'll get to see the outlaw John Marston before the events of Red Dead Redemption. I love me some Red Dead, so I'm not only excited to see a potential prequel of what's honestly one of my favorite stories in a game, I'm also hoping there's going to be another undead expansion, and please, 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 please make it VR compatible. Is that too much to ask? Anyway, we're probably going to be getting a ton more Red Dead Redemption 2 news in the coming weeks, so stay with us if you're a fan. Personally, I would love to have a first-person POV option, or possibly seeing this GTA style of gameplay being adapted to other genres. Since this is Western, maybe a space adventure in the next one? Let us know what you would want to see in the next game in the comments down below. Also, in more gaming news, Nikia, a news site, is reporting that Sony will be following Nintendo's lead and will start developing mobile games. Ooh, cool. Cool. According to this report, Sony is planning on creating mobile games based on their already existing properties. Cause duh. 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 Rumor has it that they're planning on releasing five or more games, and Sony will most likely adapt some of their PS Vita features, like cross-platform connectivity. Ooh, hey. Sexy. When the God of War game comes out, you could maybe download a companion mobile game that'll help you gain supplies, that can help you on your quest to vanquish the Norse gods. I'm so fucking excited for this one. That's not a bad idea. I'm really excited for that. <laughs> game too. We should hear something from Sony before the end of this year, but it looks like these games are meant to be released in Japan and other Asian countries before America, Europe, and so on, which is a bit of a bummer if I may be honest. Mm, well, you know you may not be. Uh Hey, as long as we get them, I am A-OK. -okay. I would want an Uncharted game so I could go exploring with Nathan Drake in the jungle. Or you could make it like a treasure hunting game similar to Pokemon Go, get some Ooh, ancient artifacts. Ooh, that ain't bad. I wouldn't mind a little big planet game. Mm. That would be really fun to take on the go. The damn sack boy is so freaking cute. And those games kind of feel like they're meant to be adapted for like a mobile yeah. platform. Honestly, I love those games, but I feel like I spend the most time just making them look it. cute. Yeah. yeah, same here. Ooh, also Ratchet and Clank. Yeah, That'd yeah, be a yeah, lot yeah. of fun. Maybe they could try another PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale. Yeah. So that game had like a short shelf life, but it could be resurrected on like the iPhone or the Android maybe. Oh yeah, well, we're not actually sure if this is gonna be exclusive to one phone or another, but let's stay positive and hope they're available to everyone and will be released in the US soon. What Sony game would you wanna play on your mobile device? Maybe Infamous? Damn, I love those. Oh, same, mm -hmm. they're so fun. Be sure to like this video, share and subscribe. Tell your friends about us. Please. Tune in this Thursday at 4 p.m. for Spooky Fed Nerd, a live stream where we watch scary movies that you vote on. Yeah, this week you guys voted on Human Centipede. Thanks. Join us. I'm Sam, <laughs> this is Whitney, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye. Number bye. two is Legends of Tomorrow. Oh, what? shoot. What? Look at that. Did they watch the same episode. <laughs> oh, hey. hey. We'll get there. We'll get I'm there. talking about Legends of Tomorrow. All right. I got things to say. So, okay, you flash heads. Wait, hold on. This is, no, this is baffling to me. This is like the mirror, mirror universe right here. <laughs>